Hey guys, Jonathan here with TLD, continuing the 12 days of top fives. This time we are looking at the top five musician tech. So whether you play guitar, drop fat beats, or just want to improve your audio, this top five is for you. So kicking off the list is actually what is being used to record this episode, and that is one of my favorite USB mics, the Blue Yeti. Now to me, this is the Swiss army knives of USB mics. Whether you wanna do podcasting, voiceovers, or record guitar, this thing will do it all. So this has a tri-capsule array, and what that means in English is there are three condenser capsules sandwiched inside, and that leads to multiple pattern options, which equals maximum flexibility. On the front, there's a built-in mute button and volume control, which is gonna work in conjunction with the built-in headphone output. On the flip side is where you choose from your different patterns, stereo, cardioid, omnidirectional, and bidirectional. Now for a more detailed explanation of what each mode does, that'll be linked down below along with pricing and availability. But in this case, for voiceover work, I am using the cardioid pattern, which also works great for acoustic guitar. So as you can see, or hear rather, this is a stellar and versatile USB microphone. It's plug and play, it's under 150 bucks, and in addition to this blackout edition, what you guys are looking at here, it also comes in silver, platinum, and black. Next up, this covers a question that I get quite a bit on Twitter, and that is what is a good, inexpensive set of desktop audio monitors? Now in this case, monitors refer to speakers, but not something like you'd find in Best Buy where they're gonna enhance the bass or color the sound. This is gonna give you a flat response. So what you hear is actually what was recorded, and that's gonna give you maximum flexibility in terms of editing accuracy. So these are the Tenoit Reveal 402 Studio Monitors. They feature four inch woofers and three quarter inch tweeters, and even a bass port towards the bottom, so you're gonna get accurate low end. Now, on the back side, there's a handful of ins and outs. You have quarter inch, XLR, eighth inch. So no matter what you have to plug in, you are more than likely covered. You also have EQ, volume control, and there's actually a pretty sweet little LED when you turn these bad boys on. Now professional audio monitors can go over 500 bucks, even over a thousand bucks, but you can actually grab a pair of these for under 250. And it's one of the best investments you can make for your audio if you don't have a lot of cash to spend. So next up is the iRig Pro from IK Multimedia. And just like the Blue Yeti, this is a multi-purpose, multi-use piece of audio gear. Now this will actually work with both iOS and Mac. And what's cool is it actually comes included with both 30 pin and lightning cables. So you'll be able to record right out of the box on a multitude of iOS devices. So this is kind of like the ultimate portable studio tool you can throw in your bag because it has a combo input so you can throw in either guitar or XLR. It has phantom power for condenser microphones. And in this case, here's an example of guitar being played into the iRig Pro into an iPad. So if you already own an iPad or a Mac and you've been looking to jump into audio recording but don't really know where to start or don't want to spend a whole lot of money, this sounds great, is super versatile, and might be just what you're looking for. Next up, this is for you beat makers out there, and I'm going to hand this off to my main man Dom who drops fat beats on the daily and has quite possibly the most badass intro tune on the YouTube, so Dom, take it away. That's right, we are talking about this guy right behind me, which is the Samson Carbon 49 USB MIDI controller, and this is one of my personal favorites. With the Sam Samson Carbon, you are getting a semi-weighted keyboard with 49 velocity sensitive keys, a compact design, and it's perfect for pretty much anything. We have an assignable data encoder, a volume slider, edit key for adjusting up to 14 control parameters, and dedicated transpose and octave buttons. It also includes a MIDI output on the back and a sustain pedal input along with the USB connections. In addition to that, the Samson Carbon 49 also includes a dedicated iPad slot, and it works with an iPad or an iPad mini. All you have to do is use Apple's Lightning to USB adapter, plug it in, and you are all set up. And if that wasn't enough, the Samson Carbon 49 also comes bundled with Native Instruments Complete Elements, so you can get everything set up and making beats right out of the box. So if you'd like to check it out, you can pick up the Samson Carbon 49 for only 99 bucks, and that link will be down below. So you guys can check out Dom's channel link down below. He hopes you have a great day. And we are closing out today's list with one of my favorite pieces of tech of 2014, and that is the Apollo Twin by Universal Audio. Now, if you're looking for quality, this is hands down the 
best interface under a grand you can get for Mac. This features 24-bit, 192 kHz audio. It's Thunderbolt equipped, so you're gonna get PCI Express connection. This is packing two premium, super low noise preamps, and this is multifunction, so you can throw either mic or line in there. You also get two line outs, and right there on the front, there's a high Z input for instruments like guitar and bass, and also a headphone output. Now, as you can see, aesthetically and functionally, this thing is top-notch, but it also sounds damn good too. The big thing with Universal Audio, in addition to the actual hardware, is the software. Because there's processing inside the interface, you can actually Actually track in real time through compressors, EQs, tape machines, and even guitar amps. So here we got a guitar running real time into one of their built-in amp sims. Now I also got an API strip running on the guitar, a studer fattening up the drums, and this is all in real time. So if you're a little more advanced into audio recording and you're looking to take that step up into the best of the best, this is definitely something you want to check out. And I will have both models and availability linked down below. So that wraps up today's video. We are continuing the streak, the 12 days of top fives. The other ones will be linked down below just in case you missed those. If you guys want to see the streak continue, definitely go crazy on that like button. It is much appreciated and you guys know every single one of you gets a virtual high five to your faces. Again, everything that I showed off in this video is linked down below along with where you can pick one up. Again, this is Jonathan with TLD and I will see you guys tomorrow with the next 12 days of top fives.